Hello everyone, you are welcome to class. In this video, we are going to talk about 43 dramas. Actually, in this video, I will be doing 5 to 6 dramas only. Uh, but in this whole series, 43 dramas we will be covering. Uh, so you know that dramas are part of uh, your syllabus, whether it's UGC Net or uh, LT English or Lecturer or any other TGT PGT level. There are always question are asked directly or indirectly from uh, dramas whether you call it development of drama we have chosen the best dramas or uh, we have chosen the dramas which are asked frequently in your exam so you must go through them and uh, when we uh, look at the questions asked from dramas section uh, or from dramas you can see that the name of drama is asked they are now, writer is asked, their year of publication is asked, and finally, their quotations. Quotations are asked from the particular drama. So, quotation part we will leave here. But next is the character. Character is asked. So, these uh, five to six type of questions are asked from different dramas. So, uh, first of all, we will go through the all names, what we are going to do. So, first one is uh, Dr. Faustus. So, first of all, we will Dr. Faustus. Ko and you of Malta, Othello, King Lear, Hamlet, Macbeth, The Tempest, Walpone, The Way of the World, The Duchess of Malfi, uh, Arms and the Men, Pygmalion, Murder in Cathedral, The Playboy of the Western World, Riders to the Sea, The History Boys, The Birthday Party, and Look Back in Anger, The Glass Managerie, uh, all of all, all my sons, death of a salesman, the Ariap, the Emperor Jones, are uh, risen in the sun. Francis, she stoops to conquer the piano lesson, the lion and the zoot, dream on monkey mountains, the clouds, mother carries and her children, the doll's house, a doll's house, ghost, the enemy of the people. Uh, top Girls, The Winslow Boys, The Dumb Waiter, Haya Vadna, Dance Like a Man, Long Day's Journey into Night, Beyond the Horizon, Anna Christie, and A Strange Interlude, and The Straw. So, we are going to start with Dr. Faustus. Dr. Faustus, and another, another name is The Tragical History of the life and death of Dr. Faustus. So, inka, iska jo second name hai Dr. Faustus ka, and uh, commonly referred to simply as Dr. Faustus. Because jo ita bada name hai, usko commonly hum Dr. Faustus ke naam se jante hain. It is an Elizabethan tragedy by Christopher Marlowe, or ye Christopher Marlowe ne se likha hai based on German stories, and uh, the title character is Faust, or isme jo title character of Faust hai. It was written sometimes between 1589-1592 and may have been performed between 1592 Marlowe's death in 1593. So, which was written in 1589-1592. Ke gaya tha. Uh, two different versions of the plays were published in the Jacobian era several years later and front piece of to a 1620 printing of Dr. Foster showing Foster's conjuring Mephistopheles. So, it's Mephistopheles. Mephistopheles is a character in that work and Dr. Foster is a character in this work. So, we will be uh, looking at the characters now. So, some of the characters are Dr. Foster's, Chorus, Wagner, Good Angel, Bad Angel, Valdis and Cornelius. Three scholars, Lucifer, Mephistopheles. So, Lucifer and Mephistopheles are important. Belgebeb is also important. Uh, Robin, Seven Deadly Sins. So, it is also asked, ye pucha jata hai ke Seven Deadly Sins kis uh, work mein the. And uh, Friars, Wintner, Martino, Frederick, Benivolio, Charles uh, V, Duke of Duke and Duchess of Van Holt. So, यहाँ पे important ये है कि जो characters के name हैं, उन्हें आप अच्छे तरीके से याद करेंगे. And we will go through some more works. So, if we talk about the other details, so it is a tragedy, and uh, it was written in 1590s in England. And date of first publication is A text was published in 1604, and B text was published in 1616. 
and the narrative chorus in this work and point of view point of view ki baat kare the faustus is a central figure in the play and he has several long soliloquies that let us see things from his point of view aur isme kafi soliloquies use ki gayi hain and tone tone is grandiose and tragic tragic tone mein likhi gaya likha gaya hai and setting is in 1580s प्रोटेगनिस्ट अगर वॉक के प्रोटेगनिस्ट की बात करें तो ये डॉक्टर फॉस्टस ही इसका प्रोटेगनिस्ट है वट आर द मेजर कन्फ्लिक्ट इन द वर्क जो कन्फ्लिक्ट की बात करें कि कौन कौन से इसमें कन्फ्लिक्ट शो होते हैं फॉस्टस सेल्स हिज सोल टू लूसीफर इन एक्सचेंज ऑफ ट्वेंटी फोर ईयर्स ऑफ इमेंस पावर तो जो डॉक्टर फॉस्टस वो अपने सोल को लूसीफर को सेल कर देता है इस स्टोरी में डॉक्टर फॉस्टस की जो टोटल स्टोरी है वो भी मैं आप लोगों को देख चुका हूँ क्लास में इमेंस पावर बट द डिज़ायर टू रिपेंट बिगेंस टू प्ले हिम एज द फियर ऑफ हेल्थ ग्रोज इन हिम सो फाइनली ये है कि उसे ट्वेंटी फोर ईयर्स के लिए काफ़ी इमेंस पावर उसको लूसीफर uh, देता है बट uh, क्योंकि वो रिपेंट नहीं करना चाहता और इसकी वजह से उसे अब जो हेल का जो फियर है वो उसके अंदर जागने लगता है and foster's study of dark magic and his initial conversation with mephistopheles aur isme jo study karta hai wo dark magic ko study karta hai foster's sealing of a pact and promises his soul to lucifer aur apna jo soul hai use lucifer ko de deta hai to ye ek hum kahe ki important event hai is work ka foster's traveling of the world and performing the magic for various rulers फॉस्टस पूरे वर्ल्ड में घूमता है और अलग अलग लोगों के लिए मैजिक को परफॉर्म करता है थीम्स कौन कौन सी हैं इसमें थीम्स हैं सिन रिडेम्पन एंड डैमनेशन द कन्फ्लिक्ट बिटवीन मीडियबल और रिनेसा वैल्यू तो यहाँ पे जो कन्फ्लिक्ट शो किया गया है वो मीडियबल और रिनेसा वैल्यूज़ के बीच में कन्फ्लिक्ट शो किया गया है एब्सोल्यूट पावर एंड करप्शन कि अगर किसी के पास एब्सोल्यूट पावर आ जाती है तो करप्शन होना शुरू हो जाता है मीन्स वो इंसान ही खुद करप्ट हो जाता है अगर आपके पास सुप्रीम पावर आ जाती है द डिवाइडनेस ऑफ द ह्यूमन नेचर एंड मोटिव की बात करें तो मैजिक एंड सुपर नेचुरल मोटिवस आर देयर एंड प्रैक्टिकल जोक्स वी कैन सी सिंबल सिंबल कौन कौन से यूज किए गए हैं ब्लड फॉस्टर्स रिजेक्शन ऑफ द एंशेंट अथॉरिटीज द गुड एंजल एंड द एवल एंजल जियो ऑफ माल्टा द जियो ऑफ माल्टा फुल टाइटल जो है वो है आपका the famous tragedy of rich the rich jew of malta is a play of christopher marlow written in 1589 and uh, 1590 ye bhi aap logo ko mil chuka hai hopefully ki aapne puri story dekhi hogi kyunki story ek bar go through agar aap kar lete hain to aapko kafi sari cheeze khud hi yaad ho jati hain ye to aapka ek tarah se revision series aap ise maan sakte hain the plot primarily revolves around malta's jewish merchant named barabbas तो जो बैरबस है इसमें पूरी स्टोरी उसके चारों तरफ घूमती है और वो काफ़ी रिच है द ओरिजिनल स्टोरी कम्बाइंस रिलीजियस कन्फ्लिक्ट इंट्रीग एंड रिवेंज ये सारी चीज़ें आप लोगों को दिखाई देती है वहाँ पर अगर आप स्टोरी गो थ्रू करेंगे तो आपको रिलीजियस कन्फ्लिक्ट इंट्रीग और रिवेंज सारी चीज़ें दिखाई देती हैं सेट अगेंस्ट अ बैक ड्रॉफ ऑफ अ स्ट्रगल फॉर सुप्रीमेसी बिटवीन स्पेन एंड द ऑटमन एम्पायर इन द मेडिटेरियन दैट टेक प्लेस ऑन द आईलैंड ऑफ माल्टा और इसमें जो स्ट्रगल फॉर सुप्रीमेसी किस किस के बीच में स्पेन और ऑटोमन एम्पायर की आप लोगों को देखने को मिलेगी मींस यू कैन फील दैट देयर हैज़ बीन एक्सटेंसिव डिबेट अबाउट द प्ले पोर्ट्रियल ऑफ जूस एंड हाउ एल्जेस एन ऑडियंस वुड हैव रिव्यूड इट कैरेक्टर्स बैरबस एबिगल इथामोर फ्रेंच डॉन लोडोविक डॉन मैथियस कैथरिन एंड द प्ले ओपन विद द कैरेक्टर मैकेबल यस आपको ये भी पूछा जाता है कि जो जो ऑफ माल्टा है वो कैरेक्टर कौन सा है उसमें है जहाँ से शुरू होता है तो मैकेबल के साथ में शुरू होता है सैनिक एंड घोस्ट बेस्ड ऑन निकोलो मैकेबली इंट्रोड्यूसिंग द ट्रेजिडी ऑफ अ जू एंड मार्लो वॉज इंस्पायर्ड बाई द ग्रेट क्रिश्चियन मुस्लिम कन्फ्लिक्ट ऑफ दिस फिफ्टीन सिक्सटी फाइव ग्रेट सीज ऑफ माल्टा और क्रिश्चियन मुस्लिम कन्फ्लिक्ट जो 1565 में हुआ था उससे मोटिवेट uh, होकर मार्लो ने ये लिखा था बैरबस बिगिन्स द प्ले इन हिज काउंटिंग हाउस इफ वी टॉक अबाउट द जेंडर ऑफ द प्ले इट इज़ अ ट्रेजिक कॉमेडी सटाई ऑन रिलीजियस हेपोक्रेसी एंड 
Machiavellian scheming, time and phase so written in uh, 1589 in London. Uh, in between 89 and 1591, this was date of first publication, uh, earliest edition in quarto, dating from uh, 1633, probably based on copy of Marlowe. So, uh, next one is uh, narrator. Narrator is uh, Narrator is Machiavelli. Uh, Machiavelli, a caricature of Machiavelli, the famous 16th century author or statecraft. Protagonist is work ka kaun hai? Protagonist is Barabbas. So remember this one. And setting, which we have seen before, that 1565 mein, Turkish seize of Malta. Malta was seized. And Malta's fortified town is the setting place. Point of view, Marlowe's the playwright, ambiguous style seems to condemn all the characters as immoral. और इसमें सारे कैरेक्टर्स को ही मॉरल शो किया गया है एबिगेल्स कन्वर्जेशन टू कन्वर्जन कन्वर्जन टू क्रिश्चियनिटी मे बी अंडरस्टूड एज द प्लेस हैवली आयरनिक मॉरल क्लाइमैक्स और जो एबिगेल है उसका शो किया गया है उसके कन्वर्जन को हाउवर द ड्रामेटिक क्लाइमैक्स क्लाइमैक्स अकर्स इन द फाइनल सीन वेयर बेरबस प्लॉट टू किल क्लाइमैक्स क्लाइमैक्स बैकफायर्स एंड बेरबस डाइज इन कॉलड्रोन और लास्ट में जो बैरबस है वो खुद मर जाता है बैरबस स्कीम टू फ्री माल्टा फ्रॉम टर्किश रूल बट हिज प्लान्स फाउंड वैन फ्रेंड्स सेव कैलमस लाइफ और जो फ्रेंड फर्निज है फर्निज कैलमस की लाइफ को बचा देता है और जो बैरबस है वो खुद मर जाता है द प्रोटेगनिस्ट आइज एंड द गवर्नर एक्सप्लेन्स टू टर्क दैट ही विल बी माल्टा इज प्रिजनर अनटिल द आईलैंड इज फ्रीड if we talk about tone deeply ironic tone you will see that barabbas is simultaneously sympathetic and detestable uh, aap barabbas ki agar story ko dhyan se aap logon ne dekh liya hoga to sympathetic story bhi hai aur sath hi sath hum use detest bhi karte hain we hate him for doing his acts and many characters are the ostensibly good christians such as phonies appear hypocritical and moralistic themes of the works are religion and uh, religious hypocrisy, vengeance and uh, retribution और इसमें जो है सबसे बड़ी जो चीज़ है वो वेंजीन है मैकेविलन स्ट्रेटजी सिंबल सिंबल यूज हुए हैं गोल्ड एंड बैरबस नोज नेक्स्ट वन इज ऑथेलो ऑथेलो द ट्रेजडी ऑफ ऑथेलो द मूर ऑफ वेनिस द मूर ऑफ वेनिस इसका सब टाइटल आप मान सकते हैं इज अ ट्रेजडी बाई विलियम शेक्सपियर बिलीव टू हैव बिन रिटर्न इन सिक्सटीन जीरो थ्री सिक्सटीन जीरो थ्री में लिखा गया है and by Shakespeare everybody knows this fact it is based on the story of Uncapitano Moro so you have to remember that it is asked by Shakespeare usually Shakespeare is asked by Shakespeare a Moorish captain by Cynthia a disciple of Bacchesio published in 1565 in 1565 it was published by Shakespeare Uncapitano Moro a Moorish captain it is based on this story and um, the story revolves around its two central characters. First is Othello, a Moorish general and in the vanity and army and his treacherous ensign Iago. So two of these characters are in which this story is going on. Othello and Iago. And Iago is very jealous of Othello. Uh, Othello is very jealous of Othello. Uh, give its varied and enduring themes of racism, love, jealousy, betrayal, revenge and repentance. ये सारी चीजें हमें देखने को मिलती हैं जो love देखने को मिलता है between Othello and uh, his wife Desdemona and uh, jealousy, betrayal, धोखा, revenge सारी चीजें देखने को मिलती हैं. Character characters are uh, first as the Othello, uh, the protagonist, Desdemona. Othello's wife and daughter of Brabantio, Iago, Othello's trusted but jealous and traitorous ensign, and Cassio, Othello's loyal and most beloved captain, Emilia, Iago's wife and Desdemona's maid servant. So Emilia, who wants to help Desdemona and Othello, ko. Bianca, Cassio's lover, and Brabantio, Venetian senator. Roderigo, Roderigo, des desolate, Venetian in love with Desdemona, Duke of Venice, Graciano, uh, Lodovico, Montano, Clown, Senators, Sellers and Officer, Gentlemen, Messenger, Herald, Attendants and Musicians.
so as we have uh, gone through that uh, un capitano moro a uh, moorish captain now uh, this uh, from here it is taken uh, highlight is we if we talk about the full name full title of the work is the tragedy of othello the moor of venice author shakespeare and this is type of work if we talk so what you should do whenever you uh, you are uh, trying to uh, challenge yourself okay when now whether you know the effect or not so just uh, uh, tell yourself five to ten names of the dramas and uh, like you can say Jew of Malta she stoops to conquer and Dr. Foster's and uh, Othello and then try to tell yourself you know the publication dates of the works and at least uh, the protagonist of the works so in this way you can build the knowledge of these dramas to yourself and what kind of genre is so it is tragedy written between 1601 to 1604 and date of first publication 1622 tone if we talk about tones shakespeare clearly views the events of the play as tragic Pure tragic we may say bataya gaya hai. he seems to view the marriage between Desdemona and othello as noble and heroic for most part and uh, late 16th century ka time ye hai and during the wars between Venice and Turkey. Venice in act first the island of Cyprus thereafter protagonist apka Othello hai agar hum baat karein ki major conflict jo pure work mein chalte hain to kaun kaun se hain Othello and Desdemona marry and attempt to build a life together despite their dis, uh, difference in race uh, age and experience means unke race is race and experience tino mein ye bhi ek tarah ka conflict hai and their marriage is uh, subtached by the envious iago who convinces othello that desdemona is unfaithful aur unki jo marriage hai use subtract kar diya jata hai destroy kar diya jata hai iago ke dwara aur othello ko ye believe dila deta hai ye vishwas dila deta hai iago ki desdemona kya hai unfaithful hai iago tells the audience of his scheme arranges for cassio to lose his position as lieutenant and gradually insinuate to othello that desdemona is unfaithful aur last mein ye proof kar leta hai the climax upon uh, occur at the end of uh, act 3rd scene 3rd mein to so, climax jo is work ka hota hai wo aapka act 3rd scene 3rd mein hame dekhne ko milta hai themes if we talk about themes uh, the incompatibility of military heroism and love aur uh, dono ka means military heroism aur love dono ki uh, dono ko in, incompatible bataya gaya hai the danger of isolation नेक्स्ट इज सिंबल दी हैंकरचीफ द सॉन्ग विलो दो तरह के सिंबल इसमें यूज किए गए हैं हैंकरचीफ एंड द विलो नेक्स्ट वर्क इज किंग लियर किंग लियर इज अ ट्रेजिडी बाय विलियम शेक्सपियर विलियम शेक्सपियर ने ट्रेजिडी लिखी है इट टेल्स द टेल ऑफ अ किंग हु बिक्विट्स हिज पावर एंड लैंड ऑफ टू ऑफ हिज थ्री डॉटर्स इसमें स्टोरी किंग लियर के सिंपली ये है कि देर आर टू थ्री डॉटर्स ही हैज थ्री डॉटर्स वी विल सी there are three characters we can uh, take them and he uh, divides his whole power in two of them aur do ke paas wo apni power de deta hai so here are the characters uh, lear king of britain earl of gloucester earl of kent later disguised as caius and fool lear's fool as a gloucester's first born son and admund gloucester's illegitimate son and goneril the lear's eldest daughter regan and the third one is cordelia so there are uh, three daughters goneril regan and cordelia duke of albany goneril's husband and duke of cornell regan's husband gentleman attends cordelia and oswald goneril's loyal steward king of france suitor and later husband to cordelia and duke of burgundy and suitor to cordelia old man tenant of gloucester and curran uh, curran is courtier of the work so 
if we talk about the source of the work so it is taken from Raphael's Hollinshed Chronicle of England in Scotland so he wrote it and uh, uh, he read it I means Shakespeare read it from uh, Raphael's Hollinshed Chronicles of England and then he wrote this work so some of the details uh, William Shakespeare wrote it it's a play and what kind of play it is it's a tragedy written in England between 1645 and it got first published in first folio uh, 1623 climax uh, glue sisters blinding in act third scene second protagonist King Leo he is ka jo hai protagonist hai antagonist antagonist ki baat kare to isme leo ki jo daughters hain goneril and regan ye dono ke dono kaun hain iske antagonist hain protagonist king leo hai and setting 18th uh, 8th century bc and various locations in england we can see the setting place themes themes are justice authority versus chaos reconciliation redemption and if we talk about uh, symbols so symbol uh, weather weather plays an important symbolic role in the play notably in act third where when the tremendous thunderstorm over the heath symbolizes layers rays jo jo bahut zyada thunderstorm wahan pe hota hai wo king lear ka jo gussa hai use show karta hai mounting insanity the actual blindness of gloucester symbolizes the moral blindness that plague both leah and gloucester himself in their dealing with their children the view to kafi sari yahan pe aapko symbol dekhne ko milenge jaise uh, weather ho gaya thunderstorm ho gaya ya uske baad uh, blindness ho gayi so blindness is there so wheel wheel of fortune is another symbol by means of which admin at the end of the play conceives of his uh, fall from power back into insignificance so these are the symbols in next uh, video we will be looking at the detail of hamlet and other five works see you in next video till then goodbye